So it looks like I've been painting and that's because I have, I've already filmed this video once, but I didn't like the outcome. It wasn't, it wasn't even that it wasn't what I expected. I, at one point, my hand got shaky and I got a bit off track with the black section and so I had to go significantly larger than I wanted to go and in doing that I discovered that I hated the piece. So I've done this once. <laughs> I know that there is definitely a change in my style from when I first painted this piece six months ago to now. So six months ago, I painted this Paint Your Style piece back in April. There was no challenge announced this week. And so I decided to go back through the Paint Your Style archive of images. And I picked up this piece from April that I genuinely enjoy painting. It was the first Paint Your Style challenge that made me go, oh, I could commit to doing this challenge weekly. And I did. I have done six months of challenges now, only missing one or two weeks because of traveling or doctor's appointments, but I've done every other week of Paint Your Style since this challenge happened in April. I know there's an improvement. I know my style has changed. But we're going to paint this again. <laughs> I liked sections of my first attempt. I'm gonna cover up what I didn't like. There are sections I really like, like the second fish and the background. I really like compared to the first one. But I have my color list from the first attempt. And I think I'm gonna use the exact same colors. I might throw in a couple extras. I've still got three spots left. But overall, it's just going to be painting it and sort of seeing how I feel as we go. I so rarely repaint things that I've just painted. Normally if I have to refilm the video I walk away for a couple days but it's Tuesday. I honestly waited until the last moment to see if they were going to paint post a challenge for this week and so I don't have time to walk away anymore. Uh, normally I have a painting video of some sort in reserve I've got Sunday videos filmed, but I don't have any Wednesday videos. So as much as I'd like to walk away and take a little bit and sort of just think through how the last one happened and what I changed, I don't have time. So we're gonna get into painting this for a second time and I am going to get out of my own head enough to paint this a second time.
so it's dry and I really like it. So this is now, this is six months ago and there's a big difference. I love the movement of this fish coming up from under the lily pad. I like that I decided not to do the tails because I really struggled with them over here and I struggled with them in the one I did earlier. And I really like that I followed the line of the splatters and that I put the lily pads in while they were still wet in the one six months ago I didn't and you can definitely tell the being able to follow the splatters is a new thing just a couple weeks ago I was still taping it everything but I do really enjoy the look I do wish I'd put the flowers in when it was a little bit wetter I did do that in the first version that I tried today. You can see just how big the fish got. But because it, they went in when it was a little bit wetter, they blended out a little bit more. And I do like that look. Overall though, I'm really happy with it. It's interesting to see what's changed the past six months and what really hasn't. I'm still a fan of the same sort of dotted background. I filmed it six months ago, so I. It will be interesting to go back and see if I did the background the same way. I have a feeling I did. I have a feeling some of the colors are the same. I think I probably <laughs> used Cosmic Creations Stormy Seas for both, just based on this section. Overall though, I think there's definitely an improvement. Like this fish had some movement, but it was sort of odd movement. Whereas this one like looks like it could be coming out from under the lily pad. My fins still need work. Both times I gave up on putting fins on the blackfish, which is interesting. Um, I'm a creature of habit and it's interesting to see when I make the same decision. Actually, all three times I did it here too. I made the same decision. So that's interesting to see the times that I make the same decision. Overall, though, I'm quite happy with it. I did debate adding a third fish up top, but I was worried that it would make it too busy, and so I didn't. And I'm happy I didn't, because I think it makes the piece sort of less busy, and I also don't know what color I would do the third fish. So, I hope you enjoyed watching this week's Paint Your Style. I currently have a poll up over on the community tab because November is a very busy month. And I am trying to figure out if people would want to see previous paint your style videos that maybe I didn't do a full length video on or would prefer to just get a couple extra Sunday videos but post it on Wednesdays instead. So. Um, I will see if I can leave a link to a post below. I don't know that I can. If not, it'll be over on the community tab. And let me know. I have a couple days left of filming content. And so I have time to film more paint your styles, but I also have some more Sunday videos that I could just release early. So I'd love to know what you think. I hope you enjoyed watching. It was definitely fun to do. It was weird to have to redo a paint your style after just painting it, but I think I learned a lot from the first one I did today, and that made this one a lot better. <laughs>